everybody. As you probably know, it's me, the Red Mage Pro, and welcome back to Grandia, the HD version. Yes! And so we're gonna try taking on the boss one more time. Hopefully, uh, with better all-around uh, consistency. Let's see, poison resistance. We're gonna need some fire resistance. So we're gonna try one more time, and we're gonna try to kind of change up the strategy a little. And by changing up the strategy, I mean I don't remember how oh, it went last time. All only that like I got creamed. So uh oh, we also kind of it would probably help if we actually had uh yeah. Let's uh let's go grab those right fast before we uh, even remotely think about this. I'll see you then. Bye. Oh. How did we miss this? Thank you. Fight me, you sissy mama! Justin, learn Shockwave! <laughs> what the heck is that? Okay, I didn't know Sue actually had like a shield. That was cool. Ooh, let's try Shockwave. A wind blow him away. Well, that might actually just kill everyone, won't it? Ooh, Fina has learned Hell Slash! Here goes! Ooh! Ooh, I like. Okay, so we're at the base of the volcano, and I don't think that we can progress any further. I legit think that, like, we have to beat the boss, and then that's it. I think that's it. We have to beat the boss before leaving. Oh, no. That's, uh, that's not good. That's not very good. Uh, so that means that we don't have any way of reviving, and while coming down here wasn't like a total waste of time, we got some level ups and whatnot. Like, it's still, uh, wow. It's gonna be an uphill battle. And I think I'm not going the right way, because I don't remember going under an arch. Huh. So, yeah, I guess it's a ride or die time. Which, you know, is all fine and dandy. You know, it's not like, you know, other games don't do this all the time where... They put you in a situation and you can't leave. It's just that, you know, those situations most of the time suck. Yeah, see, like, I think, I think we're going the wrong way. I think we need to go the other way, question mark? Where am I at this point? Yeah, I came from this way? Well, there's a save point. Why is there a save point here? Oh, is this the actual way off the mountain? Oh, don't tell me that. You're no match for me. I, I will cry if that's actually the case. Cry of happiness, of course, but
How... How did I manage to go all the way back from the place that I had come from to this point? I, I am baffled. Speckledorfed even. That's not even a word and I agree with it. Well, if anything, I think that we just gotta climb up this ramp. What? I'm, I'm sorry, but what? Oh, okay. Yeah, I vaguely remember this. I remember getting hit by that. And... Okay, we're at the crater now. As we get ambushed. God dang. Man, that is, that is freaking crazy. I, I, I will say though, I am about to be the richest god dang man once I get out of here. Because I know that I have so many rain staffs. Like look, we have so many that we can't carry anymore. That's how much we have. See, and like I remember this. Okay, we're, we're back. We're back to where we originally were. Whoa. Oh, and I forgot about these guys. Oh, well. But they're taken out. I know, maybe we'll go, go see like what that other route is all about because I don't know if we actually went there in the last recording. But I wanna, I wanna make sure that I go save, rest up, save, and whatnot, J -j just to be in like a nice, safe little position, you know. Oh, okay. And, and who knows? Maybe that's going to like lead to. Ooh, there is a shiny. I'm gonna overwrite my save twice because that's what you do in RPGs. It's just something you do because you're never really sure if you did it the first time or not. Trust me when I say that's like a thing that like everyone in my family do. Everyone, even my sister, and they don't even play RPGs. Very funny how that actively like hands up. Not bad, eh? And oh, let me tell you, like you guys are gonna have so much nice content coming. Cause like I recorded quite a bit. Blocked by all manner of things. Lovely. I won't tell you. Only that, like, uh, you know, got some new games as well. Not new games, but like some. Uh, uh, I got old games. That, like, you know, we typically play. Or at least played on the channel. Jesus! Oh, that's a rock. Poor Justin. But like, um... Freaking... I also want to play Axiom Verge. I'll probably play that on my own. But like, on my own time. 
and like, you know, upload on my own time. You know, probably play through the entire game. Because apparently that's like a really, really good uh, Metroidvania. And you know how I feel about Metroidvanias. And there's a second one that like recently came out too, which I'm very interested in. I do love me a good Metroidvania. Which is why I'm also looking forward to the next Metroid. I also really want to play like the old, old, old um, Metro, uh, not Metro, but Castlevania games. I got the collection. I do know that much. Prevents damage below 10. Wow. Get rid of the health weed and we'll auto that. Yeah. Not that that's going to help us against the boss. Because it's not. The boss is just going to deal way too much damage. Oh, and then I should... I know I've been, like... I, I played a game, right? And I got that fully recorded, ready to go, ready to be edited. You know, show you guys and all that different type of jazz. But, like, you know, after I finished it, they, like, teased that they were going to put in, like, a secret boss. And I don't know if they ever did that or not. I should relatively see if they've done it, so I can play it, and then add it to the actual, like, you know, video files. Because, like, honestly, that game is great. That game was definitely great, and I can't wait to also do, like, the second part one. The second one that they basically made. Look at that thing! Kill it! Just not with fire because it's a mad dragon. Ha! We're just gonna like abuse our magic and just annihilate the frick out of this thing. We're also gonna use runner so that like we can like uh just, I don't know. Probably just get faster. And I think, doesn't that like hit like... Yeah, so it, it, it hits other people, so like, we're good on that. We're also gonna use a uh, Dragon Cut, because why the F wouldn't we? Come, power of the universe. We're fighting a dragon. dragon Makes fight. sense. Crazy effects, I, I, I swear. Very beautiful. Somehow that hits Fina, but not Sue. We'll do Tremor. And that's gonna, it's gonna hit both. But basically, I think like the idea is to hit, try to hit both areas so that they both stop for a while. I think that's roughly like an idea. Please protect us. I should have honestly have also put like fire charms on the rest of them. The head just keeps moving. I'm just gonna like up the defense of everyone. Because that's that's gonna be like the one thing that's actually gonna save us. Hopefully. Yeah, I think that, like, the idea is basically to up our defenses right now. While, uh, probably, like, also upping our speed. Just basically, like, getting all of our stats up in order to take down this dragon. 
It's probably a good idea. I don't know. Is there like a difference between magic damage and physical damage? Oh, the hand's about to make a move. I think Justin just needs to like endure. Okay, now it's using Howl Slash, which hits everyone, and Fina's in a bad position right now. And there goes Fina. Do I have the revive item on uh, any of my guys? At least, no. Not on him. What about Godwin? Well, we need a heal. So might as well do that. Chill out. Tell the dragon to chill out. Justin learned snooze. Who do you have? No. Okay. No. Got happy for a second, but no. Man, I'm not even doing any sort of, like, damage to this thing. Heal up Sue. There, there. If it chooses to hit Justin, he's screwed. I don't think it did, but still, oh man. They're there. Like, oh man, how how would we fight this? Excuse me, you're about to heal. Well, maybe we just need to, like, just freaking combo it. So a god dang stop moving. You know, that's, that honestly looks like it's doing a lot more than our magic has been. If I'm being perfectly honest. Health weed. How did that not hit me, Justin? Oh no, Godwin! You're a cheater! <laughs> then again, so are we. We're technically yeah. cheating. How is that 
kept missing everyone. I don't understand. Mid air cut. Okay, we're running that- I'm gonna run that back, so Fina doesn't die. Let's see how this looks! Woo! That was... kind of a nice animation. No one died. Okay. Let's go ahead and do this like we normally do. Turn out the fire scroll actually helped out a lot. Yes! We did it! Ha 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 ha! Indeed, Justin! Now Justin and Fina don't have to be sacrificed! Uh, Justin? What's that glittering? Look! Look! Over there, too! Hmm? What, Fina? Uh-oh. Uh I've seen this before, guys. I see now. These are the same things we saw at Typhoon Tower! But doesn't that mean... Ah! Wow! What's happening? The volcano has come back to life! It will start erupting right away! Yikes! This is the crater here! If it erupts, we'll all be sacrificed! No. More like... Sacrified. No time for word games! If we don't get out quickly, we'll all be toast! <laughs> Alright, time to recover, save the game, and uh, try to make our way towards the base. But seeing as how we saw how the base was like, uh, was, how did, how did Godwin and Sue get here? Thinking about it. Huh. Kinda weird. Well, anyways, I'll be doing like a short recording for this. For today, at the very least. I got like, I did a lot of stuff today. Recorded two different games already. Uh, not only that, but like these ones take like roughly uh, 45 minutes to get like an episode out. And I've already been doing them for 45 minutes. And who knows exactly how long it's gonna take. And all the cutting and editing I'm gonna ha uh, end up uh, doing as well, so. That's also like, I don't know exactly how much I'm gonna have, so might as well make one episode out of it, get my bearings, and then like work on it, another uh, recording of it later, while probably maybe recording something else. I'm feeling good today. I'm feeling good to record today, and it's weird. Normally I don't feel this good. And normally like I don't record so much in one day. I think kind of throughout the day. Maybe I just, like, need to, like, be doing this more often. Because, I don't know, I feel like, as of right now, I'm kind of in, like... Mm, what's it called? It's not so much of a funk. It's more or less so... Huh. There's a word for it. Like, you're not depressed, you're, uh... You're... Mm, it's not a breakdown, either. But, like, if anything, like... I don't know, I... It, I more or less feel... Kinda like... You know that... I, I don't know if you ever got... You ever have this feeling, right? Where you kind of feel like you're watching yourself from, like, the outside. Now, I, for one, don't relatively feel like that. 
but you kind of say that like it feels equivalent to that maybe i don't know it's kind of like my life feels like it's going on without me if that makes sense like my life is passing me by and i'm just kind of experiencing it it's a weird feeling to be sure Ooh, cutscene. but you know all the while like it's not like i feel like i'm in any trouble mentally let's go ahead and focus on the cutscene for right look the volcano is erupting Boo! That's a very. That's actually really nice. I kind of like the. I dig the way that, that is. Oh god! Has the volcano come to life again? You better hurry to the base. Let's go, Justin. Ooh, ow, hot! Yes, Godwin! Everybody run! Ah! Oh, look, we're just. Miraculously here. Let's go to the shop and then we'll freaking beat up everybody. This is the inn. The shop's on the other end. Right? Here we go. Tool shed. Look at these are 2,000 a pot. Like, think about that. We could definitely, like, just go there and... Did I just sell, like, her equipped one? I feel like I might have. I'm going to just... No, I did not. Okay. Like, look at that. We we made bank being up there. So much goddamn bank just by going to this place. We have no mana eggs, however. And it's not like we relatively, like, are in need of anything right now. Not until the next place, so that's already pretty good. Eek! It's a ghost! A ghost! Stay away! You were supposed to have been eaten by the fire dragon! Why, brave couple? Why? We were bad! Please don't haunt us! Ooh. Wah! It's looking this way! Hey, hey, hey! Souls of the brave couple! Don't lay a finger on my girlfriend! I, stoic and dangerous Muda! Marua will put you away with one blow from my right hand. Look, we have just returned here after barely defeating the fire dragon. W what? Is it really you? You really are something. I'm so happy that you were unscathed by the sacrifice. I'm going to murder you. Hey, Lena, run and tell the chief the good news. There'll be a festival tonight. Marua, I don't want to go alone. Oh, Mura, I don't want to go alone. Come with me. Oh, my spoiled princess. Okay, Lena, I'll go with you. Oh, brother. Come on, Justin. Don't be angry. Let's go, too. Auspicious. Auspicious. Never has it been this auspicious. Ja la la! Death to the fire dragon! Lu lu lu! I don't remember the voice I gave him. May Gumbo be forever warm! A sacrifice is not necessary! From now on, until forever, we can celebrate the festival! This is great! I, this is just how I feel like I gave him the voice. To Justin and Fina, who slew the dragon, and to Godwin and Sue, those two couples will go down ever after in the history of Gumbo as the brave co- Don't be putting Godwin with Sue, you are a creep. 
<laughs> now then, please don't hurry. Eat more and drink more. No, no. We've already had enough. We're so full. No more. My stomach's full and I'm tired. Have you fallen asleep, Puffy? Yeah! <laughs> I too have a full belly. I'm going back to the lodges ahead of you. I'm hidden the sack. Justin. Fina. Since you're the guests of honor, we better enjoy it a while longer. Jalala! I'm sorry you can't stay. Shall I see you to the lodgings? Good night, Justin. Don't stay up too late. What? Godwin and Sue will soon be gone? Soon? It already happened! Fina! Fina, what were you drinking? What do we do, Justin? We have to kiss in front of everyone at the end of the festival. What? Really? <laughs> it's a lie, Justin. A lie. Did you think it was true? Say, it's gotten a little hotter. Can we go outside and cool down? Alright, let's go then. It probably doesn't matter if we're here. Justin, you're making eyes at me just now. What are you saying? Do you want to go or stay? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm sorry, Justin. Well, let's go, Justin. It looks like the T from, like, if you guys ever played Pokemon Stadium from the Lickitung gang. Oh my god, I hate that game. That, that's what that looks like. Ah, the evening breeze feels good. Now everybody is a couple in this village. I feel embarrassed just looking around. You know, actually, now that I think about it, how old is Justin? Like, I, I, I know that he's old enough for his mother to, like, not so much as to, like, bat an eye of him leaving on his own. But Sue is a child... And it really just makes me wonder. Like, what's their, what's the age gap here? Is he as old as Fina, or is he a bit younger? Because, uh, honestly, I feel like Fina's, like, a lot older. Just because she's, like, mature, she's more experienced. It's just how I feel. I should look this up. Look, they're everywhere. Oh, brave couple, thanks to you, Gumbo is full of happiness. Yeah, I bet. You sons of guns. We owe it to you. Thank you very much. I didn't think that I would ever be walking together with Dania. Wonderful. You're a happy couple. You're also a marvelous couple. Right, Nina? Nina. Her name is Nina. What did I call her, Nina? Eh, why not? Wow, you know, I haven't seen any freaking... Like, I opened up my phone, and the first thing I see... Is, like... Something from the game I just played. And it's not like I see a lot of videos on that. But it's just funny that I saw it right there. I'm not gonna spoil it. You guys will find out. You'll see. Because I'm also looking it up. Now tell me, Dana. Dana. Is there anywhere nearby that is cool? Let's see. Try going to the pier or the isolated islet. I... Islet? Islet. It'll be cool and you can relax. Alright. I think it's like right here. I think that we go like here. Wow, they're all over the place. Is everybody a couple here? Jesus! We shouldn't bother them, Justin. Let's go to the islet. God dang, they are god dang everywhere. Like, I don't know how I feel, right? Because, like, uh... For me, like, it kind of, 
it's it kind of stinks the way the, the things that they basically do, you know. This is Don said. This is a quiet place. Oh, okay. So here we go. They actually do have ages. They actually have ages. Apparently, Justin is 14. And God, he looks really cool in his god dang splash art. I wonder if I can... I'm, I'm going to try to see if I can actually, like, put this up. He looks good. Like, the art for this game is, like, no joke. Like, really freaking nice. And I freaking love it. Oh my god, Fina is just, like, one year above him. Wow. Okay. That is... that That's weird. I'm also going to pretend that I didn't see what I just saw. And Sue... Sue is apparently eight. Okay. So, none of that. I'm going to try to forget what I just saw. Because there was a little bit of a spoiler in there. How dare you! <laughs> but that's fine. Doesn't change anything for me. I want to see how that's implemented, though. We'll see. We'll see. Don't worry. Nothing more for me. I'm sorry. The smell of the sea breeze at night is wonderful. Isn't it, Justin? What? Maybe so. Feels like noon to me. Already, Justin? Let's try going over there. The sound of night waves is so wonderful. What? Wait a minute, Fina. What? What is up with that face? That face right there is just so. Uh... Hey! <laughs> Look, Justin. It's just as if the starry sky descended. It's just like two people floating up into the sky. Truly. But as the adventurer, Justin, sometimes I would like to go up and face that star. Let's go together sometime. To that most distant star. <laughs> what? The two of us together? To that star? <laughs> Justin. You, said, you just said something nice. Do you know what it is? Well, of course. It's only fitting for an adventurer. Oh, Justin. Don't you ever stop thinking about adventure? Hey, if we do this, we'll look like a real couple. Isn't that a laugh? Of course we look like a couple. Our relation goes back to plunder and marriage in New Parm. What? But, but that was because of the sniveling pack on. Yup, yup. Oh dear god, he's here. <laughs> it's just a joke. Just a joke. Now what was that about him being here? Uh, nothing. Oh, uh, but Justin. I think it's been great going out on adventures with you. Honest. Ever since I met you. Adventure and trouble have been continuous. Even in this village, we are still wrapped up in confusion. Fina? That doesn't sound much like a compliment. You can resolve these things just by taking it all on. You have that kind of wonderful strength. Oh! <laughs> yeah! Look at that! I love it! Like, uh, I don't know. I, I, I tend to, like, fan at these things, and I don't, I don't know why I do. I just love it when, like, something like this happens. Is it, with, is it the same with you guys? If you see something, if you see, like, these two characters, you kind of know they like each other. And they kind of start going down the romance path. And then you see, like, the flag happen. And if you don't know what the flag is, the flag is just basically, like, uh, freaking visual novel terms for when, like, something important happens and the relationship just kind of, like, from that point on is much grander, you know? This is a flag, and quite honestly, I love it. Fina, perhaps it's looking ahead. But Fina, about myself. Shh. Quiet. Feels good just like this. Seems like you and I are the only ones in the whole world. 
freaking god dang suing dude is like over there like right across and they're just like looking being creeps oh no uh what's that the spirits they're here too just like we saw them at Typhoon Tower in the volcano. Doesn't that mean a natural disaster is about to, like, happen? Think about it. The tower collapsed. Can't necessarily call that a natural disaster. But these spirits are kind of harbingers of, like, something bad. Volcano erupts when these things are around. Something bad's about to happen. Like, is there a tsunami going to happen? What are these spirits trying to tell us? How pretty. This is actually very pretty. I actually like this. Oh, this is beautiful. I love this. Oh, that was crisp animation. This is a PS1 game. I know it's a remaster, but come on. That was beautiful. Does it bother anyone else that Godwin looks like this? But he doesn't necessarily look like this, like, in his splash art. Like, seriously. Like, look at that. It's like his sprite has been whitewashed. Compared to, like, his, like, actual, like, character portrait here. Normally, you seldom encounter the spirits. But the two of you saw so many is extraordinary. I think that the spirits favor Justin. Don't you feel that in your heart? Yes. I've been able to see the spirits ever since we came across the wall and came here. The spirits appeared to Justin last night and at Typhoon Tower. Now then, these are more appearances than I've ever heard of before. I think that they must have something in mind for Justin. The spirits are those softly flickering lights, aren't they? How could they intend anything? The spirits are more than that. I don't know. But if you go to the place called Allen, you'll find out. Okay, let's go ahead and talk to Sue. When I fell full yesterday, I suddenly got sleepy. So I went right to bed. Oh, that was delicious. I really wanted to see pretty spirits floating in the night sky. <laughs> Too bad, Sue. Next time it happens, I'll wake you up. But the spirits are so strange. You never saw them in Parm, did you, Justin? She has a point. Like, why are the spirits kind of like showing up to Justin right now? The spirits were dancing in the gorgeous starry night. There was something about it. Even now, it feels like just a dream. Don't you think so, Justin? Well, yes. Now that you mention it, Athena, when I certainly saw them, that was no dream! Last night was truly beautiful. I will never forget it. Now then, last night after we parted, Donda and his friend came to the guest house. As thanks for saving Gumbo, he said he was making preparations, so we can leave by boat at any time. Great luck! Now we can finally go to the Twin Towers. I thought that we would meet up with the Li Liette when we crossed the barrier. Somehow we went the long way around. That's just because originally, Justin was bad at everything. Have you reflected on that, Justin? Look, I understand. Well, that's okay. It means that we've had so many more adventures. Right? All right. You know what? We what we'll, we'll save right now. I think that what we'll save one to here. However long it's been since like I've been playing and how long the video is, whatever time that I end up cutting it to, I'm pretty sure it'll be all right. So I want to thank each and every one of you for watching today. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next recording.
See you guys. Bye bye. Bye now. Bye bye. Kaka. 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 Bye bye. Kaka. Kaka. Bye bye.